Hi, Firsty friends. Welcome to our story time today. I am so excited because we're starting a whole new unit. And this unit is about taking care of your family. And as we're reading our books, I want you to think about why is it important to be a part of a family? And what do you notice about families? Today, we're going to begin with a story. And in this story, we have two characters. This character is Tia. Tia means aunt in Spanish. And she is the great aunt of the little girl, Cecilia. The girl is hugging her great aunt. What can you tell about Tia? What can you tell about the girl? Well, in this story, uh, the girl is getting ready for Tia's birthday party to celebrate her 90th birthday. What do you do when you celebrate birthdays? Wow. The girl tells what she and the cat will do before the party. Watch for how they make a specific gift for Tia. And our story is called A Birthday Basket for Tia by Pat Mora and illustrated by Cecily Ling. Here we have our title page and we can see that cat again. Watch the cat in the story. Birthday Basket for Tia by Pat Mora. Today is a secret day. I curl my cat into my arms and say, Shh, chica, can you keep a secret, silly cat? Chica means girl in Spanish. Today is a special day. Today is my great aunt's 90th birthday. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90! 90 years old. 90 años. At breakfast, Mama asks, What is today, Cecilia? I say, Special day! Birthday day! Mama is cooking for the surprise party. I smell beans bubbling on the stove. Mama is cutting fruit, pineapple, watermelon, and mangoes. I sit in the backyard and watch Chica chase butterflies. I hear bees bzzz. I draw pictures in the sand with a stick. I draw a picture of my aunt, my Tia. I say, Chica. What will we give Tia? Who is Cecilia? What is special about Tia's birthday? Cecilia is the little girl, the main character in the book. And what's special about Tia's birthday is she's 90 years old. That's a long time living and needs to be celebrated. Chica and I walk around the front yard and backyard looking for a good present. We walk around the house. We look in Mama's room. We look in my closet and drawers. I say, Chica, shall we give her my little pots, my piggy bank, my fish, my dancing puppet? I say, Mama, can Chica and I use this basket? Mama asks, why, Cecilia? It's a surprise for the surprise party, I answer. 
Chica jumps into the basket. No, I say. Not for you, silly cat. This is a birthday basket for Tia. I put a book in the basket. When Tia comes to our house, she reads it to me. It's our favorite book. I sit close to her on the sofa. I smell her perfume. Sometimes Chica tries to read with us. She sits on the book. I say, silly cat, books are not for sitting. Look carefully at the book. Why does Cecilia choose that book? Ah, on the cover and back cover, you can see a cat that looks like Chica. Maybe she likes that book because it's like her cat. <clears throat> I put Tia's favorite mixing bowl on the book in the basket. Tia and I like to make busy cochos, sugary cookies for the family. Tia says, Cecilia, help me stir the cookie dough. She says, Cecilia, help me roll the cookie dough. When we make the warm cookies from, when we take the warm cookies from the oven, Tia says, Cecilia, you are a very good cook. I put a flower pot in the mixing bowl, on the book, in the basket. Tia and I like to grow flowers for the kitchen window. Chica likes to put her face in the flowers. Silly cat, I say. I put a teacup in the flower pot. That is in the mixing bowl, on the book, in the basket. When I am sick, my aunt makes me hot mint tea, herba buena. She brings it to me in bed. She brings me a cookie too. I put a red ball in the teacup that is in the flower pot, in the mixing bowl, on the book, in the basket. On warm days, Tia sits outside and throws me the ball. She says, Cecilia, when I was a little girl in Mexico, my sisters and I played ball. We all wore long dresses and had long braids. Tia seems to spend a lot of time with Cecilia. What are you thinking about, Tia? Oh, interesting. Chica and I go outside. I pick flowers to decorate Tia's basket. On summer days when I'm swinging high up in the sky, Tia collects flowers for my room. Mama calls, Cecilia, where are you? Chica and I run to hide our surprise. I say, Mama, can you find the birthday basket for Tia? Mama looks under the table. She looks in the refrigerator. She looks under my bed. She asks, Chica, where is the birthday basket? Chica rubs against my closet door. Mama and I laugh. I show her my surprise. After my nap, Mama and I fill a pinata with candy. We fill the living room with balloons. I hum, hmm, 
a little work song like the one Tia hums when she sets the table or makes my bed. I help Mama set the table with flowers and tiny cakes. Here come the musicians, says Mama. I open the front door. Our family and friends begin to arrive too. I curl Chica in my arms. Then Mama says, shh, here comes Tia. I rush to open the front door. Tia, Tia, I shout. She hugs me and says, Cecilia, que pasa? What's this? Surprise! We all shout. Feliz cumpleaños! Happy birthday! The musicians begin to play their guitars and violin. Tia, Tia, I say. It's special day, birthday day. It's your 90th birthday surprise party. Tia and I both laugh. I give her the birthday basket. Everyone gets close to see what's inside. Slowly, Tia smells the flowers. She looks at me and smiles. Then she takes the red ball out of the teacup and the teacup out of the flower pot. She pretends to take a sip of tea and we all laugh. Carefully, Tia takes the flower pot out of the bowl and the bowl off of the book. She doesn't say a word. She stops and looks at me. Then she takes our favorite book out of the basket. And guess who jumps into the basket? Even though Tia doesn't say a word, how does she show her feelings as she takes out each item from the basket? Yeah, she shows that she likes the flowers by smelling them. She shows that she loves the things by the way she holds it in the picture, the smile on her face in the way she looks at Cecilia. So guess who jumps into the basket? Chica! Everyone laughs. Then the music starts and my aunt surprises me. She takes my hands in hers. Without her cane, she starts to dance with me. You can see Chica in the basket in the back. How fun. Well, remember friends, we're thinking about family. Talk to me a little bit about um, Cecilia and her family. Yeah, she has her mama and her cat Chica and her great aunt Tia. And they do something special for the people they love in their family like throwing a surprise birthday party. Today, I want you to think about why does Cecilia choose each item to put in the basket? And then talk about that in your response video and add it to your assignment. 